about to go down. The Blood Syndicate is a fictional multicultural vigilante gang of superhumans created by Milestone Comics and published by DC Comics. The team first appeared in Blood Syndicate number one, April 1993, and was created by Dwayne McDuffie, Ivan Velez Jr., and Denny's Cowan. The Blood Syndicate differed from other supergroups in being a gang. In fact, they were the surviving remnants of multiple street gangs. Thus the name, a combination of Paris Island Bloods and Force Syndicate, who had gained superpowers in the so-called Big Bang and decided to use them for greater purpose. However, their constant infighting, the unsustainability of their methods, and the lack of central vision, particularly after the death of the first leader, led to the Syndicate's eventual disintegration. The surviving gang members eventually came together and formed a new gang that consists of Tech 9 Flashback, Fade, and Dog from the Force Syndicate reached out to whoever else they could find. They reached out to the Psycho Holocaust first, <laughs> but of course, he killed them all with his firepowers. But Flashback saved them with her power to turn back time three seconds. They convinced him not to attack them this time, and again, he helps them recruit Watson. By threatening his family, they found Third Rail in a homeless camp deep below the streets, suffering from guilt over his father, of course. They tricked Juan Templo into leaving the safety of a local church to join them. The group agreed to work together and, after a healthy disagreement, chose the name Blood Syndicate, a combination of the names of the two rival gangs they came from, Force Syndicate and Paris Bloods. They first action, their first action as a gang was when they attacked a crack house, that's crazy, to steal the money for operating expenses. Their raid killed many addicts and criminals and gained them another member, Masquerade. He was hired to guard the drugs, but the new gang recruited him to join them instead. They went back to Ground Zero, the place where the Big Bang happened, only to be ambushed by a large contingent of local criminals. Templo was killed, but the new gang worked together and killed every last one of their attackers. After returning to Earth, the gang barged into Utopia Park uninvited. Their presence caused a riot. Wise Son was responsible for stopping it, as chronicled in the Milestone crossover event, Long Hot Summer. Tech 9 persuaded him to use the Utopia Park PA system to appeal for an end to the violence. Wise did so eloquently, and the ride is back down. After this, they had a final battle with the Demon Fox. They found out that she dug up Tech 9's body and gave his essence to Masquerade. This enabled him to impersonate Tech so well that he actually believed he was Tech himself. And to wield his powers, the Demon Fox and Masquerade, who was enthralled the, the fox to the Fox, fought the Syndicate tooth and nail during the fighting. The Fox revealed that Brickhouse was pregnant with Third's baby and apparently caused her to miscarry. Kwai rose up and destroyed the fox. At the cost of her own life, Kwai didn't perish. She reverted to nine-year-old Nina Lamb. But seemingly with Kwai's memories, the syndicate now knew that Masquerade was born female and confronted him for his deception. He proclaimed that under his leadership, they became more efficient than ever before and that with him, they could achieve their true potential as a team. He convinced none of them, <laughs> none of them. And then, left the team in disgrace. Wise Son disagreed with his methods but admitted that he was right and that they never lived up to their hype. He states that they all kept too many secrets from each other and that they fought each other <laughs> more than their enemies. Now that's crazy. The team decided they were tired of the pain that they had endured and the constant violence around them and disbanded. A few days later, while recounting the events of the past ordeal to Rob Chaplick, Dog appeared before Wise Son and told him that the syndicate isn't over. It just stopped for a while, is all. Wise Son smiled and replied, Thicker than blood, G. Thicker than blood. Since their disbanding, the blood syndicate left a hole in the hearts of its members. Powerful people left to fend for themselves. Holocaust made his inevitable return and reinstated the blood syndicate as they once were, a gang. He tried to take his actions out into the streets and claimed Dakota City as his own, but the others rose up against him. Wise Son challenged Holocaust to a battle for rightful leadership of the Syndicate. Wise Son won, and it seemed that Holocaust burned himself to death. Yet again, it remains to be seen. If Holocaust actually died, but Wise Son became 
the undisputed leader. Wise had ideas to bring his family to the light away from Holocaust fire. Now that's crazy. Dope. Blood Syndicate. Dwayne McDuffie. Rest in peace. Stay tuned.